Hey guys, thanks for joining me again for another bath bomb demo. Okay, so this one is a last pour Yorick from Bare Naked Bath, and I've been holding on to this one for a while because this is another LED bath bomb. I did her jack o' lantern LED bath bomb, and I just thought it was so cool. I have never had one like that before. I haven't ever seen one like that before, and she has another one, um, and this is it. I think that this one is going to put on a really cool show because I think it's got even more than just the LED in store for us. This one is scented in an earthy blend of subdued florals and musky woody ambers and that's the Santal scent. This is a unisex scent and she says, the owner of this company, she says this is one of her favorite scents. It is, to me, it is a really kind of subdued scent and I really do like it. It um. <laughs> to my limited knowledge of scents like this, it is just a woodsy, earthy scent and makes me wonder if <laughs> it's kind of like one of those scents that people describe kind of like, um, sounds weird, but like dirt, um, just like woodsy and dirt, but it's really nice. It's like, it's got a really organic scent. I don't know if that makes sense to you guys, but I really do like it. Um, also, the blood oozing out of his eye is a cocoa butter melt, so I think that's cool. Um, I am going to go ahead and try and cut the lights off for a minute like I did last time because I did think that was cool, but I'm going to leave them on for the most part because I thought it was really, really pretty to see um, everything that was going on with the balm too, so I'm going to try and do it like I did last time. But anyway, let's go ahead and get him in the water because I really can't wait. Um, I've just been saving him for October because I think he's going to be really cool. So anyway, let's go ahead and get him in the water. Just like I remember her last bomb being, it is really, really strong and fragrant, so that's, that's nice. So I could tell that it was going to have some colors coming out of it because it had like little, like little specks in the white. His bloody eyeball just keeps bobbing up and down. It's so funny. So as of right now, I might be wrong tomorrow when this when this gets posted, but as of right now, this is still available and she's got um, her jack o' lanterns still available and she did restock them. I think she ran out of them and then she restocked them again. So um, these are both um, available right now. And she's got a lot of other really cool stuff in her shop too. really do like the way this smells. Now, so this is never anything I would have picked out for myself. Oh, there it goes. There goes the lights.
Now, I don't want to cut my lights off right now. A, I'm leaning over the tub. Ooh, there it goes. And B, it's still got bath art coming out of it. So, I'm just going to wait a minute. That's just so cool, though. And it's so bright that it even shows up in these bright lights. I'm going to go back down here and check it out. Yep, it's still got a bright pink coming out of it. A good bit of it. Loved that light. How cool is that, you guys? It's so cool. I love it. I love it. It's awesome. I love it. <laughs> I love it. And it's still got embeds coming out of it and still making bath art. That's just, that's awesome. It's just so awesome. And the tub is just filled with just different ribbons of color. It's just, I'm just so impressed. Y'all, I live for this stuff. I just, I really do. This is just so pretty. It just did not disappoint, not one bit. And this is a very interesting scent to me. I like it a lot. I really, really do. Okay, so let's go down and check out the final watercolor. Oh, so pretty. It looks like a crayon. Okay, this is the exact color I'm seeing is what you guys are seeing. Um. I don't know, what color would you call this? Is this like an indigo? Is that cross between like a blue and a purple? Because that's exactly what it looks like to me. There's a color Gatorade that's this color, this exact color. Um, I'm kind of scared of drinks that are this brightly colored, but um, I still get them sometimes for my kids when they baby sports. But anyway, um, yeah, this is just, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous color. Okay, so I'm going to take my little, um, oh, here, let me grab it for you guys. It's over here. Um, LED ice cube, if you didn't see my last demo. That's what it is. Flash ice cube. And it's going to keep flashing for a little while. So cool. I love it. Um, so I'm going to put this over here, and we will check out the bubbles. So this is just an awesome reference just for me and my memory, all these videos. It's awesome. It looks like there's just like red swirl on the top, like where that bath art was. So that's cool. And from what I can see, you know if you can see it on this screen, it looks to be a little pink cast on top of the bubbles, which I always think is cool when the bubbles are, um, are kind of colored. 
that means the water is just really pigmented and I like that too. Okay, well let's go down and go ahead and check them out. Yep, definitely got two or three inches of bubbles in here, so that's great. my last poor york bath i was in there for a while you guys okay so the water it was just electric the bright color the indigo blue i just loved it um there wasn't a lot of sparkle in the water but it did glisten on top and i think that that's because of whatever oils or butter she used it was just there was a really pretty sheen on top of the water and i will let you guys see there's really nothing left in the tub there's just a teeny tiny bit of some kind of sparkle but there really wasn't um, much to speak of and there's really nothing left on my skin this bath bomb was also really fragrant um, in the air is is very much still lingering and on my skin and like I said whatever butters or oils she used um, were very moisturizing as well so definitely go and check out her Etsy shop I will have all of her links listed down below I do have one more of her bath bombs to use and I'm excited about that because it is one of my very favorite scents it is her keepsake coffin bomb and it is in the scent of bite me so I'm excited about that but I just I appreciate you joining me tonight and I will See you next time, so thanks a lot. Bye-bye.